From News Channel 5 Weather, I'm meteorologist Leland State. I'm keeping an eye to the sky with Harvey moving our way because of that. A storm five alert for this afternoon and tonight morning, mainly scattered showers out there, low clouds and patchy fog. There will be times where it may be rain free because we've got waves of rain, bands of rain moving through the area. Now, when Harvey begins to get a little closer to us later today, we'll keep an eye to the sky this afternoon, early tonight. A couple of the storms could be strong to severe in this area in yellow. We'll watch it. There could be a quick tornado uh, spin up uh, with this. Look at rainfall amounts. Now this is from let's say 8 o'clock this morning and doesn't already include the rain from last night. Here at the station, we picked up nearly an inch of rain overnight. So we're talking this uh, an additional rainfall for us out there. So there you see another three inches for Nashville, another four and a half to five for Clarksville, Camden five through here. Those areas could get about five to eight inches of rain here in Nashville on average three to five as you head to Cookville Crossville on average one to three inches of rain. Now this is based on the projected path of Harvey. If Harvey moves a little to the east, a little to the west, the flash flood watches that are out for Nashville, Lebanon, uh, Franklin. For now, it doesn't include Murfreesboro, but the, the watches could be moved just a bit depending upon the track that Harvey ends up taking. Let me show you what's happening right now as we work our way through the day with exact tracking and it does show showers, but then notice some breaks in those uh, clouds in the rain. So the rain threats there all day, but there will be periods where it does not rain. Meanwhile, tonight sounds of a game tonight. Hmm, it may, may be dicey for that because the rain is going to increase. Here comes the core of that system. By one o'clock, it's going to be sitting right there. By one o'clock tomorrow afternoon, about right in through here. So that's going to bring rain and thunderstorms into the region. Tomorrow is going to be a windy, raw day. Highs between 65 and 70 degrees. And then as we work our way in the uh, Friday uh, afternoon, Friday night, the system pulling on through. But here we go, football Friday night. There will still be scattered showers around for football games on Friday night. And then as we head into Saturday, still a few showers out there. Here's a wider view of Saturday. You see the spin with that. So a few more showers coming in, especially let's say from Nashville East Nashville North head to Dixon Paris Jackson. Uh, you look to get a pretty good day on Saturday. Then we all look to have good weather in here on Sunday. This afternoon, upper 70s to right around the 80 degree mark tonight, 68 tomorrow, 70 some spots not out of the 60s tomorrow, uh, a windy day tomorrow as well. And then the seven day now showing 77 Saturday, 83 Sunday, 86 on Monday, Labor Day. Rachel is our weather artist today. She's got an appropriate weather scene. She's got the spin there, the swirl with a with a hurricane off of the East Coast. She's got you the aerial view and the ground view. So a uh, very nice there from Rachel Stewart's Creek down in Smyrna. Meanwhile, our school of the day North Stewart Elementary out of Dover got a note from Amber Fu Fu Fuquay. Amber says her daughter Elizabeth is a first grader there in Mrs. Allen's classroom. So I appreciate all of you all for stopping by. Have a fantastic day and stay with News Channel 5 and CBS News on air, online and on the go for the very latest on what's happening with Harvey in our area and rescue efforts continuing in Louisiana and in Texas.